G'day gang, Gimmel here, down here, how you going? Back at Elder Scrolls Online in the Greymoor. Uh, I want to go and just discover this lightless hollow great lift. Oh, hang on a second. You want a piece of meat? Yeah, that's what I thought. I'll take those spider eggs and I'll eat them right in front of your dead body. That's a bit strong, isn't it? It's a little bit strong. Alright. Let's go and discover this little Atlas Hollow Great Lift. Alright, very good, very good. Any quests nearby? So having a look at the map, we've got the uh, the ritual site. I haven't really seen anything else here, so I think we might check out this zone before returning to Princess Vanna. She has been waiting quite a while. Very patiently, I might add. Yes, okay. Greymoor Cavern. Alright. What do we have over here? A veiled deer buck. Something there in the distance. Oh, we do have a quest. I see it. Oh, Ingfrid's work order, another one. Lizard, time for you to learn prospecting. Go to the areas talked about. If you find anything that seems promising, take some samples and bring them back to me here in Dusk Town. Don't forget where each sample came from. A bonus goes to whoever finds a good seam. With luck, you might just buy your way out of this place. Ingfrid the Tall, that punk. A crude bag filled with chunks of rock. All right, so we've got two things that we're going to return, actually. Descending downward here. Oh, hello. Look at that. I'm free. I believe I'm free of her. Real Mere. I escaped. I never thought I would escape. I... I have to get out of here. Are you alright? I am now. I think. I was part of a larger group heading into Greymoor Keep. Lady Asenia. She was looking for some help. Promised good pay. But as soon as we stepped in the gates, we were attacked. They dragged away the others, and I... I ran. You just ran away? Well, that's not the whole of it. A Khajiit woman came to my aid. I've never seen someone move so quickly. It allowed me to escape. A Dusa, that was her name. She told me to find someone named Gwendis outside. But I have to go. I can't stay here. Gwendis? I'll find her. Uncover the truth of the Blood Queen's vile experiments. Uh huh. Look at that. Gwendus is above somewhere. The way shrine nearby. What's this? Oh, Greymore Keep. Oh. Alright, maybe we'll come back. I'll focus on this quest first.
There's too much stuff to look at here. In fact, there's another quest here too. Let's grab this. The Way Shrine. There is another lift over here. I'll just make my way to the lift first. Sees it's at least it looks like it's close by. Aha. Okay, that's another lift discovered. Black Reach Breacher. Discover all the entrances to Black Reach Greymork. Oh, okay, cool. So we've done that. Oh, no, that's a good... That's a view. Greymore Keep in the background. Just where we're heading. Where are you, Medusa? Wait, you there. What do you want? Gwendus, this is... I've, I've been sent to find you. I'm not looking for a fight. I just want to find my sister, Adusa. She's stuck in Greymore Keep, and I aim to get her out. Simple as that. Now, should I start swinging these axes, or can we talk? Greymore Keep. Uh, look up. It's hard to miss. Lady Asenia, the Blood Queen, holds court inside. Or at least she did. Apparently she bent the knee to some ancient vampire from the West. She's called on every vampire in Skyrim to join her here and do likewise. So she's conscripting the vampires into an army? That's what we thought. But the vampires who go into the keep never come out. Adusa slipped in with a group of recruits to take a look around. That was days ago. It's been too long. I'm going in after her. I could use a hand, if you're willing. Alright. I'll help you find your sister. You're a lifesaver. Literally. If all goes well. First, we need to find a way into the keep. Greymoor elites and their death hounds guard the main gate. No use trying a frontal assault. We've got to find another route. A post and door or something. You really think there's an alternate route into the keep? It seems unintuitive, I know. But I've snuck into enough castles to know there's always another route. A post and door if we're lucky. A sewage pipe if we're not. I'm feeling lucky. How about you? Well, I guess we'll see. Where would this door be if it existed? If I had to guess, far side of the courtyard. It's a long, open approach. Too many sight lines to breach in a siege. Luckily, no one's expecting us. Plus, the patrols seem to favor that area. Guards need to have something to guard, right? Who are you again? <laughs> Introductions. Sorry. Ugh. If my master could see this, he'd be aghast. Gwendus of House Ravenwatch, at your service. House Ravenwatch? Haven't heard of us. Good. We're the children of Count Verandis, Lord of Ravenwatch Castle. He taught us to control our urges, to use our dark gifts to defend people rather than enslave them. Hardly common knowledge, though. So, mum's the word, eh? What brought you and your sister to Skyrim? Oh, nothing much. Just rumors of arcane cyclones in subterranean castles, that sort of thing. We go where our troublemaking kin go, and our kin are definitely up to trouble here in Skyrim. I just wish there were more of us. Where's this Count Verandas you mentioned? He's... I'd rather not speak about that if you don't mind. Let's just say he's very far away. Too far away to be of any help. What more can you tell me about this Blood Queen, Lady Asenia? Not much. Frustrating, right? My sister and I make it our business to know all the major players in vampire circles. Until a few weeks ago, we didn't even know this place existed, let alone who sat on the throne. Frankly, it's a little embarrassing. What have you learned so far? Well, she's ruthless. No surprise there. A cunning alchemist, too. What I find most remarkable is how she's managed to avoid all the scheming and politicking. I haven't heard a single vampire plotting her downfall. That's... 
unusual. How so? Vampires live for conspiracy. It's practically the national sport. Local clans like the Volkahai haven't moved against her, and they've got a lot to gain if she falls. It's weird. And now she capitulates to an outsider? I don't get it. The Western Vampire must be pretty powerful. Or clever. But yeah, powerful's more likely. Between you, me, and the stalactites, anyone strong enough to pluck a castle like this out from under a vampire like the Blood Queen is someone I'd just as soon avoid. Let's go, Gwendus. Let's get in there. Let's start with the courtyard. I'll meet you there. Oh, that's a neat little trick. <laughs> Why don't you just find the place first and tell me which way to go? So there's an entrance just down here. The vampire feeding grounds. Ugh, this place is crawling with Asenia's troops. They've got to be protecting something. Let's just hope it's an entrance. Let's try to keep things quiet, all right? Keep an eye out for anything or anyone who might get us into the keep. I'll do the same. Right, I'm looking. <laughs> Dude and his death hounds. Oh, we got a blood knight. Uh, there's a blood knight charging right at me. I'll charge right at him. Eventually. Hang on a second. Oh, maybe I won't. I'll just charge you that spider inside. Oh, here we go. Some vampire dust. this. Mason's engineers and crypt wardens take heed. Our successes come quickly now with the Ashen Lord's aid and foresight. A new era of dark abundance awaits us just beyond the storm. Alas, greater success brings greater scrutiny. Long years of shadowy seclusion have allowed us to grow lax in our defenses. Many walls need mending. Our once great gates creak and moan under the weight of neglect. This will not do. I hereby declare a term of renewal. I shall not end until the walls of Greymoor Keep are once more unassailable. The eastern gate requires few major repairs. The main's gate renovations began shortly after the Ashen Lord's arrival. I fear that the western portions of the wall require the most attention. Numerous stone alcoves remain passable. These corridors proved invaluable during the blind blight siege, but that threat has passed. So too must these passageways. No structure in Tamriel matches the sublime grandeur of the timeless horror of Greymoor Keep. Like our will, the walls of this place must never falter for king and kin, Lady Asenia. I heard Gwenda saying something, but she didn't give me time to read. I guess she went to look for the breach. Look for some cracks in some walls. That Blood Knight's pounding that spider as well. Enter the Greymoor Keep Undercroft. Gwendus, I see this you. This looks promising. Let's just hope it leads to a Dusa. Unless I miss my guess, the horrors we've seen so far will pale in comparison to what waits behind these doors. But as long as we stick together, we'll make it through. Now, 
Let's find my sister. Greymoor Keep West Wing. The reins and bridles of leadership are a burden I refuse to bear. Let the Ashen Lord rule over Greymoor Keep if he chooses. I much prefer study, research, and experimentation. These are the jewels I claim my heart. So far, so good. Just watch the shadows. I'm a creature of the night, and this place even gives me the creeps. Books to read, books to read. Yes. No, Quindus, out of the way. Ah. Don't know why, but for some reason in Greymore, the bookshelves are really hard to target. Like, it comes up real brief like. It's kind of frustrating. Oh, actually, there you go. If you target the side of it, you seem to get it. Okay. Oh, oh. Don't flee up! What are you guys doing? Experimentation no more. Ah, that makes it a lot easier now. What is that? Looks like eggs. This guy... This guy's eating eggs while he's doing all that. Oh my goodness. Skeleton over there. Alright. Anyway, focus, focus. There's a scavenger there. There was a scavenger there. Like that! Can't seem to rescue anybody. They're all harrow fiends or something. I'll do anything she asks. Be silent, Chur. I won't tell you again. What was that? Adusa. Adusa, are you here? Where is she? Go on and check that balcony for a release mechanism. Don't worry about me. I can handle myself. That's not what you- what? Look at these people, the skin, the eyes. What is this thing you're doing to them? To a Dusa? I know these vampires might have misguided loyalties, but no one deserves this, whatever this is. Do you think that the vampire really knows where a Dusa is? <sighs> I've been tortured before. I would have said anything to get out of it. Anything. Then again, he's our only lead. I guess we'll have to risk it. So, how do we open the pens? I don't see any gates. Yeah, yeah. Just let me... Ah, got it. Look up. See those chains connected to the cages? We need to find the mechanism that lifts and lowers them. Up on that balcony, maybe. Mechanism on the balcony, got it. I'll go up and have a look. Good. I'll keep watch down here, just in case any of Asenia's soldiers stroll through. If you manage to open the cages, I'll grab our informant and meet you on your way back down. Just hurry. We're all undead, but he really looks the part. What do you think Asenia did to these vampires? Poisoned them, 
I'd wager. Some sort of alchemical experimentation. To what end? That's the question. I just have to believe that Adusa's weathered the effects. She's tough as an Alakir mule. Even so. No. She's fine. She has to be. Have you ever seen anything like this before? No. Thank goodness, right? Watching someone suffer through the initial effects of the vampiric malignancy is no spring picnic, but at least you know they'll be sane when it passes. This, though? I don't know what this is leading to. Why would Asenia do this to her own kind? Depends on what you mean by her own kind. Not all vampires are created equal. Most vampires become what they are by contracting a disease. Others, though, purebloods, can trace their powers right back to the source. To Moloch Ball. So you think Asenia is one of these pure blood vampires? Wouldn't surprise me. Huge underground castle. Hordes of minions. Obvious megalomania. She fits the type. The bad news is pure bloods wield far greater power than an average vampire. The good news is... Well, I guess there is no good news. Sorry. Alright. Up to the balcony. Keep climbing and climbing and climbing. Oh! Just pretend we didn't see that guy. Don't think we'll be able to avoid him though. Let's take him out. Blood Knight. Don't blood night. You're free. Get out of here quickly. Except you, Nord. You're coming with us. What? No! We'll talk outside. I'm not going to. You are going to, or I'm going to throw you back in that cage. Now move! You're as bad as a senior. Okay. Find Gwendus and the prisoner. Alright, you're safe. Now talk. You're fools if you think you'll survive this place on your own. I've seen what Asenia does to people. You... You have no idea what she's capable of. This wood elf's friend, Adusa, she's likely dead. Or worse. We'll take our chances. Now, tell us everything you know about Adusa. Fine. If you want to be her next test subject, so be it. The Blood Queen lured my clan here with promises of protection and glory. We were a small family, just four of us in all. So we came to Greymoor Keep expecting a warm welcome. What happened when you arrived? They cast us into those pens like dogs. It didn't take long before the test started. They forced us to drink tinctures, endure injections, they slaughtered anyone who refused. Occasionally, Asenia would come down to select someone for further study. And Asenia selected Adusa? Yes. Most of the Khajiit died early, but that Adusa weathered it without so much as a whimper. Asenia mentioned a laboratory beyond the Arboretum. She said something about completing the transformation there. That's all I know. Now let me go! Alright, we'll look for this laboratory. The interrogation is over now, right? I need to... I need to find a healer. A witch to purge whatever this is out of my blood. You got what you wanted. Now let me go. Not so fast. I need to know more. <sighs> Can't you see I'm in pain? I'll answer a few questions more, but I need to escape this place. I... I can't think... My companion heard that Asenia ceded her castle 
to a vampire from the West. Is that true? Yes. The Ashen Lord. No one mentions his name. They only whisper about him. The way peasants whisper about Aldwin while they clutch their prayer stones. I've never seen him, but if Asenia swore fealty to him, he must be something horrible. Did Asenia tell you anything about the test you're undergoing? Only that it would unlock our true potential, our hidden strength. Unless my hidden strength is vomiting bile until nothing's left but heaves, I think she's missed the target. What a load of skeever piece. It did drive a few vampires mad, though. Mad? Mad how? I mean just what I said. They went feral, hissing and growling like animals. Sometimes I feel like I'm bound for the same fate. It's been harder to think, to talk. The light gets too bright sometimes, even candlelight. I have to find a healer. You said to do so whether or though. Better than most. I wager that's why Asenia took her to the laboratory. The Blood Queen's looking for something specific. I don't know what it is, but Yoradusa might have it. Too bad for her. Look at these people. The skin. The eyes. What is Asenia doing to them? To Adusa? I know these vampires might have misguided loyalties, but no one deserves this. Whatever this is. That's not what you said. A laboratory, eh? Fair enough. Our informant will be alright. Or he won't. We gave him a fighting chance. What he does now is up to him. Let's go. Let's go. Going on here. You ain't gonna live. Oh, we got some loot over here. A little bit of gold. Can't check out that trunk. What's your portrait doing here? Why is the king of solitude? What's going on? He's got a fan. A dead end. Damn it. No signs of an arboretum or a laboratory. There's got to be a way through. Why is she just standing there? Mistress Messer will be here soon. Notice in place. He will find what he must. Now leave! Cannot talk to outsiders, or Mr. will have head. Yeah. Crypt wardens and servitors, access to my laboratory remains restricted. For that reason, I have reconfigured the entry to confound underlings who wander these halls in error. Call this simple phrase to mind when looking for the door. We shall rise again. I trust you can infer the rest on your own. If not, you have no business entering my laboratory in the first place, Lady Asenia. That note. This place is even worse than I thought. Come on, let's find a use for that passphrase. Vampires and their hunters? Chaotica? Blood fiends of Rivenspire? Let's start reading them all, or what do I do? Law book discovered. A secret door. Of course the lunatic alchemist has a secret door. Let's go! 
I was saying there was something else I had to look at over here. Oh, that's done. Must finish, must clean. All the books in place, even the secret one. Go, go. Must not be seen talking to others. Must clean, must work. Oh, poor fella. Can we put him out of his misery? I guess not. What do you reckon, Gwendus? This must be the Arboretum that prisoner mentioned. We're getting close. I recognize some of these plants. Reagents for poisons. Mind-twisting hallucinogens. What is Asenia doing down here? Look at all this vegetation. How does it even grow down here? Watch your step, all right? Take it from a wood elf. Not all plants have your best interest in mind. Yep. Expecting one of these to just grab me. The Strangler, that's the type. Please, no more, Blood Queen. My veins run dry. Or is it my roots? What? I can't see. What's happened to you? What? Wait, who are you? You're not here to, to prune me. It hurts so much. Asinia, Asinia did this to me. The transformation didn't take hold, you see. My blood's too thin. Like water, she said. Thin as water. Transformation? What transformation? The crimson ascent. The journey to blood knighthood. It hurts. She twists your heart, your mind. Draws out the wrath buried in the blood. Makes you stronger, faster. All it costs is, is everything. Let me help you down. You can tell me more about these blood knights. No, no, please. Every branch, every root, like a raw nerve. An exposed vein. Please, just let me die. Stop, Simia. Stop her blood knights. We forfeit our souls. Make it worth something. Make it. I'll do what I can. Asenia means to turn a Dusa into one of these beasts. One of these blood knights. Not on my watch. Oh, let go of me. Research notes the air of Verandus. Destiny smiles on my labors, all to, and an altogether unexpected specimen arrived at my doorstep. A specimen that could be open a thrilling new avenue of study. The Kajit calls himself a Dusadaro. When questioned about her vampiric origins, she became evasive and non compliant. Even after the application of my truth serum, she refused to speak about it. It matters little. I deduced her lineage immediately. Her smug contempt for our work and dedication to secrecy stink in the traitorous of Verandas. May he suffer the sun for all time. Despite Verandas' low character, his blood holds intriguing properties. His insufferable temperance makes finding Yaz very difficult indeed. For one to blindly wander through my gates could only be a sign of fate's delight in my great works. Verandas' blood is unique. With the proper reagents and preparation, I believe I could craft something truly awe-inspiring. A new state of vampirism that could exceed even the oldest purebloods in power and potency. My blood knights might simply be the beginning, a herald of something truly spectacular. We shall see. So, 
Essenia needs an heir of Arondis? Damn it. What could the Count's bloodline have to do with this? Adusa has a strong will. Stronger than mine. She'll fight this transformation as long as she can. But no one can hold out forever. We have to move faster. Let's go. I'm going. Is that water or...? Wait a moment. Can we talk? Something else? Yes, Gwendus? Sorry. I know we don't have much time. I just need to prepare myself, you know? And I need something from you. What's wrong, Gwendus? Whatever we encounter beyond these doors... Blood Knights, Lady Asenia, even this Ashen Lord... I can handle that. But if we find my sister Adusa, and she's been transformed... I need you to do what's necessary, because I won't be able to. Asenia has other plans. That book said with an air of Arandus, she could create something new. Yes, something even worse than a blood knight, no doubt. That's hardly a comfort. Just promise me you'll do what you have to do. Adusa deserves better than whatever Asenia has planned for her. I'll handle it, Gwendus. You have my word? Good. And you know, thanks. I wish my master Verandas was here, but with you by my side, I still feel like victory is possible. Let's go, Gwen. The Cathedral of Blood? And Lady. Has... No! The ritual is almost complete. Deal with them! Who's gonna deal with us? Gwendis, help me! You're too late. The experiment nears completion. The heir of Verandas is mine! Let's get up. Oh, it's not over yet. Scamp. Take a breath. Then we're getting you out of here. So, you helped this one sister, yes? Helped her find Adusa. You have the thanks of House Ravenwatch, Walker. We have little to offer, but our memory is very long. Now... You killed that monster, Essenia. Yes? We did. Are you all right? Hey, this one has seen better moons. I... I do not know if any trace of Essenia's corruption still flows through my veins. Adusa feels weak, but clear-headed. Unlike the Blood Knights. Only time will tell, yes? Will killing Asenia stop the Blood Knights? Hard to say. Asenia took long notes, you see? Very thorough. One of the Ashen Lord's alchemists may pick up where she left off. But it will take time. Time enough to strike this latest threat to Skyrim through the heart. Why was Verandas' bloodline so important to this ritual? A good question. One Adusa has asked herself many times. Unfortunately, only one person can answer that. 
and he is far away. We will have time to think on this later. First, we must escape this place, yes? Fair enough. Let's get moving. Come on. Those blood knights will be on top of us any moment now. I'll take care of Adusa. You go on. Meet us at my camp outside, alright? Okay. I'll see you there. Yeah, that, uh, that's not water I'm running through. <laughs> that's something else. We gotta get just outside. Uh, the exit's right in front of us. Okay, back to the camp. Quite a high ceiling over here. Informant will be all right, or he won't. We gave him a fight. Yeah, hey, see him. A laboratory, eh? Fair enough. Our informant will be all right, or he won't. We gave him a fighting chance. What he does now is up to him. Let's go. It's weird. All right. Anyway, I'm glad to see you made it out of that place in one piece. I had to carry Adusa half the way. After everything she's been through, she needs her rest and a meal. Will she be all right? I... I honestly don't know. I hope so. There's so much I don't know about the Raven Watch bloodline. About Verandas' origins. Will the strength of our blood help her heal? Or will it cling to Asenia's experiments all the more? It's a mystery. She survived the experience? Just take it day by day? Yeah, you're right. I'll keep a close eye on her. And I have a few alchemists that owe me favors. The important thing is that we're together. Sisterhood is a powerful bond. It'll take more than some gross experiments to break us apart. I believe it. Take this. Call it a keepsake for everything you've done for House Ravenwatch. And for me. The vampiric threat still looms large here in Skyrim. But with Asenia out of the way, I think we've got a fighting chance. Next stop, the surface. After this business, I'd be willing to go topside in the middle of the day. Are you alright, Gwendus? Of course I am. Just thinking about what we saw in there. I always felt like I had a grip on what vampirism was, you know? But now the world's filling up with monsters I couldn't dream up in my worst nightmares. Verandas never prepared us for this. We faced it together and succeeded. You're right, of course. But this isn't over. Not by a long shot. I'm sorry. I'm babbling. Just tired, you know? I need rest. We'll probably be here for a while. You're welcome to shelter at our camp whenever you pass by. 